information here at 5 o'clock on the man who shot an Arlington police officer serving a drug warrant. Vincent Hall had been out of prison just four months after serving time for another attack on police. Jason Allen live in Arlington tonight. And Jason Hall was released under a strict set of rules. Uh, Kaylee, the Texas Department of Criminal Justice told me today that Vincent Hall was out on what's called mandatory supervision. And yes, he would have had a strict set of rules to live under. But Arlington police got a tip that not only was he selling marijuana, but he was armed. They shot a cop. They shot a cop. They shot a cop. A neighbor caught the moments right after Arlington police forced their way into a home with a drug warrant. And Vincent Hall started firing at them with an AR 15 style rifle. Police said Hall hit the first officer through the door, an 11 year veteran of the department. He went down. Um, there was a total of five officers that returned fire. Um, they were able to grab our officer that went down in the door frame and pull him to safety. It was the second time in two years Arlington police were involved in a violent fight with Hall. This video from January of 2016 shows Hall wrestling with officers and trying to get a gun away from one of them. He was eventually captured in Kentucky, sentenced to three years and nine months in prison, but was released after less than a year. Hall was killed in the shootout Tuesday, but the officer he shot survived. But there's going to be some recovery ahead for certain. Um, he also has some what we believe is probably shrapnel wounds. The doctors will determine that to his elbow, uh, his legs. Police told us that they did end up finding uh, marijuana, cocaine, hydrocodone, and Xanax in that house, and they believe that all of it was being sold. Now, there were four other people in that home along with Hall. Police have only arrested one of them who had some open warrants out of another city. Live tonight in Arlington, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News.